Greetings, everybody. It's your old pal Frank here, and happy Friday. TGIF, folks. We made it through the week, and now it's time to cruise on into the weekend. So, folks, today we're opening mail. Big surprise, right? Right. Anyway, so today I'm going to be opening three items. Two from Trading Card Database, and one from Twitter. Or, sorry, X, formerly known as Twitter. I keep forgetting. Twitter's going through its prince phase right now. <laughs> anyway, but the item that I will be opening from X is the one I'm most excited about because uh, the cards that are going to be in said package are from a stack sale. And I love stack sales. So I'm kind of curious what cards I got because, to be honest with you, I forgot. <laughs> so yeah, so there's going to be some cool stuff shown today. But of course, before we open anything, you know the routine around here. Before we start anything or open anything, we need a card of the day. And I figured since on Monday I showed those gorgeous secret layer Magic the Gathering Jurassic Park cards that um today I would show something dinosaur related since I have been on a bit of a dino kick. And um, the card I'll be showing today is not from Tops or Bowman or Upper Deck or anything. It's actually a cutout card. So, nice little throwback to the 90s for you. And um, it's from my last year's advent calendar. And, yeah, I had an advent calendar last year. So sue me. Had one this year, too. Had a Hot Wheels one this year. It was awesome. <laughs> but last year's was a Jurassic Park one. And as I said, it had dinosaur cutout cards on the back of it. And, well, to be honest with you, the only one that I was interested in was this one right here. The T-Rex, of course. So, um, yeah. There's our card of the day. And, Matt, can you believe it? A T Rex was nineteen thousand five hundred and fifty five pounds. Holy moly, can you imagine seeing that? You know, just going across the field. And it's hard to believe something that big were related to chickens, or chickens were related to those. <laughs> okay, I'm I'm thinking too much about dinosaur chicken relations here. We got to open some packages, uh, but of course, in the wise words of one Mister Brendan Jensen, I have my penny sleeves at the ready, and uh, unfortunately, I won't be opening any fire. But well, some of these cards are pretty fire. Also, I have a top loader. I gotta get more of these. Luckily, Walmart has started selling like these big four packs of uh, top loaders. So I will be stocking up on those soon. As well, I gotta get myself some one touches because I got some stuff coming in the mail pretty soon that is very one touch worthy. So, um, yeah, excited for that. Anyway. Let's um let's get crack in here. I'm gonna open Whoa <laughs> I just took you guys for a ride. <laughs> okay, you guys okay? Okay. Uh I'm gonna open the trading card database stuff first. <laughs> oh my god. I made your head spin. <laughs> Okay, so let me get my good buddy Buck. There he is. Say hi to Buck, folks. All right, now let's let's cut this sucker open. Man, he he taped this thing up pretty good. Uh, tape is no match for Buck. Ain't that right, Buck? <laughs> OK. 
Okay. Oh no. I see my nemesis on the inside. Oh no, wait, wait, wait. It could be a false alarm. It could be a red herring. It is! Yay! I saw the dreaded blue painter's tape. <laughs> All right, let's pull these up. Ooh, nice. Nice, nice, nice. We got some 65 tops in here. Oh, yeah. And yes, don't worry, that, that 65 Tops video is coming, uh, I won't say soon, but it is coming. <laughs> I'm going to pull all these out, oh wow, he even put them in penny sleeves for me, what? That's cool, I like that, I like that, a little added protection. Get your minds out of the gutter, folks. <laughs> you were thinking it. Come on. You can't pull a fast one on old Frankie boy here. <laughs> okay. Wait, did he send me all of them? No, okay. Send me a couple, though. Finally have one. I'm gonna have to try and get a an updated one though. This one's a placeholder. You don't know what the heck I'm talking about. <laughs> you will when you see the cards. Okay. So you go there. You go there. Or actually you go there. And then you guys go there. Okay. <clears throat> you go in the garbage. Okay, so first package. As I mentioned, we got some 65 tops. My favorite top set of all time. So we got Mr. Jesse Gonder. We got Stan Williams. We got Dave D. Boucher. We got Fred Whitfield. Al Jackson. And Johnny Lewis. And then we got three checklists. We got the third series checklist. Yes, they are all marked, but hey, to find unmarked 65 tops checklists, um, they are very pricey, so I didn't mind that they're marked off. And the one I did the trade with, he even told me, he goes, unfortunately, they're marked. I'm like, that's okay. I don't, I don't mind. So we got third series, fifth series. And sixth series. Then we got a very cool baseball card. This is from, I think this is from 1974. Uh, yeah. 1974 tops. Card number one. Hank Aaron, new all-time home run king. There's a baseball card, folks. Mm. I, I've wanted this one for a while. Now, as you can see, there's a lot of chipping or whatever around the um, edges of the card. So this is indeed going to be a placeholder for now. I am going to try and upgrade this card. But when I saw it on the um, the guys for trade list, I was like, I, I got to go after it. And lucky me, 
he he accepted so yeah very happy about that and then this oh my god i love this is what 93 yes 1993 action packed i love the cards from that set because they're like super thick and they're embossed and there's one card in particular from that set it's the last card of the set again like with the hank aaron i saw it on this guy's list and i was like i want that and now i have it and it is of course Abbott and Costello, who's on first? <laughs> if that ain't an awesome card, I don't know what is. And if you have never heard who's on first, uh, pause this video right now and go check it out. In fact, there's a link in the description below to the who's on first skit. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> all right so that's uh that's package number one and we're at like 11 minutes so we're we're doing great and in fact abbott and costello they're gonna they're gonna go up here hell hank aaron's gonna go there with them <laughs> all right so they don't fall like that okay all right Package number two. Da, da, da. Okay. Hopefully this, this should be easy here. Or not. Okay, I'm just going to do the old letter opening style here. There we go. And then we cut into you. And then do the old slicey dicey. Very nice. Oh, nice. This shipper used uh, an old pro set box. <laughs> I like that. That's cool. Okay. Let's cut through the tape. Pull these out. All right. We got a lot of variety in this one. We got baseball, hockey, comics. Okay. So, in package number two, also from Trading Card Database, we kick things off with... Some 1996, five, six, 1996 Fleer X-Men. Now, I've showed you my Fleer X-Men set before, and I was only missing about four or five cards. Well, now after this, I will only be missing one card. Yes, very excited about that. So, we got... The Silver Samurai, the Evil Sauron, not the Lord of the Rings Sauron, the Pterodactyl Guy Sauron. <laughs> we got Hurricane, Deadbolt, Banshee. And Deadpool's gal, Domino. That's awesome. Now for the hockey, we got, uh, what's his name? How do you pronounce this? We got Mud Brunetto, and I think that's the the actual one. There's there's a there's an error card where the picture isn't him on it. I think that's the correct one. I'm not sure. Uh, we got Charlie Gardner. Mike Huff. And we got Mr. Kurt Bennett. 
And, oh, I forgot about this. This is uh, 0203 Upper Deck. We got a Marty. We got a Marty Brodeur. So, hello. 661 on the counter. Very nice. And then we got some baseball. We got some more of these uh, 93 Upper Deck team star cards so we got for uh we got for the cubbies we got the ivy leaguers of course and that's uh randy myers ryan uh, ryan sandberg and mark grace then for st louis we got the running red beer uh, red birds so who do we got on here geronimo pena ray lankford Ozzy Smith and Bernard Gilkey. All right. Then for Colorado, we got the Rock Solid Foundation. So, of course, you got Dante Bichette. We got the Big Cat, Andres Galarraga, and uh, who the hell is that? <laughs> Dave Need or Nide. I, I really didn't know that. All right. And here we got from San Francisco. We got Giant Sticks. So, of course, you got Barry Bonds in the middle before he started taking his vitamins. <laughs> and then you got Will the Thrill, Will Clark, and Matt Williams. Here for the Astros, we got the Shooting Stars. And that's Doug Drabeck, Craig Biggio, and Jeff Bagwell. And we got from Chicago, the other side of Chicago, we got the South Side Sluggers. That's what Frank Thomas, yeah, Robin Ventura and Frank Thomas. And we got, of course, the Brew Crew, Paul Molitor, Pat Lisnack or Listash, however you pronounce it, and Robin Yount. And then, of course, we've got the teammates checklist. That is, of course, Joe Carter and Big Mac himself, Mark McGuire. Am I right? I am right. Of course, don't mention Joe Carter around ripping for rookies. He doesn't like them that much. And then... From 92 score, there's, I think, four or five uh, cards that are, like, you know, homages to players of yesteryear. I have the, I think it's the Ty Cobb one, but I saw this one, I was like, I, I need it. That's right. You could probably tell from the Browns jersey, or... His rookie card up in the corner. It's Mr. Satchel Page. <laughs> All right. So that's that. And now we can get to our Twitter package or X package. <laughs> Come on, Buck. You're not done yet. Now you're done, Buck. Now you could, you could go rest. Say bye to Buck, folks. <laughs> okay. Oh, blue painter's tape. Curses. Actually, it's not that bad. Because this shipper used cut out from a priority mailbox and when the painter's tape sticks to it it's easy to pull off <laughs> so I don't mind it that much this time alright oh we got some cool stuff 
Ooh, I think I think we got some some one touch worthy cards in here. I think so. Well, for starters, we got a fifteen sixteen UD Black Lustrious Rookie Auto of Andreas Athanasiu. That's pretty cool. That sucker's thick. Holy moly. It's very nice. And then we got... This is from... 2020 Tops. On the 84... 5? 85, I believe, design. We got a Carl Yastrzemski. All-star. Nice. Nice to add to the Yaz PC. Then, we got a couple of short prints here. So first off, we got the Splendid Splinter, Ted Williams. See, even these, these, these are going to go in one touches for sure. These are awesome. So we got Ted Williams. We got the Say Hey Kid, Willie Mays. And we got the Iron Horse, Mr. Lou Gehrig. And then to wrap it all up, from 2021 Panini Playoff, we got a Rookie Stallions jersey of Mr. Amon Ra St. Brown. I figure what the heck... The Lions are actually in the playoffs, so anything's possible. <laughs> but that's actually just a really cool mem card. So, And I wanted an Amon Ra rookie for a while. I saw this one pop up, and I was like, yeah, I want that. And that's it. We're done. Yay, we're done. Hallelujah. <laughs> So, there you have it, folks. Three package mail day for you. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, you know the routine. Like, comment, all that good stuff. And then, of course, if you want to, you don't have to, but if you want to, before leaving, click that big old subscribe button. Also, click the bell next to it, too, so you get notified when my videos go live. Alrighty, so uh, again, if you didn't do it when I told you to, go check it out after watching this. Down in the description below, there is a link to the famous Abbott and Costello Who's on First Skit. You're going to love it if you've never seen it before. I, I guarantee it. And um, yeah, that's about it. So uh, again, hope you enjoyed this video. And um, I hope you all have a great remaining Friday. Hope you guys have a killer weekend. And I will see you back here on Monday where... Hmm. Do we do mail? Or do we do my top 10 of 2023? Decisions, decisions. We'll find out on Monday. So till then, yes, yes, I'm leaving you on a cliffhanger, so sue me. So till then, folks, I say to all of you out there, Laters! <laughs>